Hi folks, me again. Just a little update on my fizzy. Um, I haven't had time to do much on it. I mentioned in the last video that I was hoping to get a another rear mudguard. And I managed to get this one. Um, it's good. It's original. It needs good um, polish. But it's not all blistered around the chrome like this one is. It's a bit rusty on here, but it's only surface rust. So I'm literally going to get the little wire brush on there. Put some etch primer on it and some silver on the inside. Um, unfortunately, there's a couple of holes here. Perhaps someone had a mud guard, a uh, mud lap on it or something at one time. But I just put some rubber grommets in there, I think. So I'm happy with that. That came along. I also bought some headlamp ears so these ones hopefully will go straight on I don't know if they're dented or not they look a bit dented but uh, we'll have a play with that what I have noticed with this one these chrome ones hit the tank I don't know why that is but looking at these even if they weren't dented these are slimmer and these are off the um, same type of bike an X a DX so all I'm going to do with these is polish them up and fit them. Um, I've also bought this cover here for the chain guard on the other side. These a little bit of work. Got to weld a little eye on, and there's um, a little bit been cut out here. So a little bit of work on that. Give it a sandblast and some silver paint, and and on um, the sticker. I've got some new stickers here. This one looks like it was off a foreign bike. Um, so hopefully it will fit okay. I've got these stickers here. There we go. So, um, I've been looking forward to getting these little jobs done. And the other thing I did do, I mentioned it on my last video, I wasn't going to do it. But I couldn't help myself. And I bought another saddle. So this is probably made in Vietnam or China, I'm not sure. But it's um it's supposedly a fizzy saddle. I'm not sure whether this one is or not. I should keep this one just in case it's original to the bike, but it doesn't look like it. But this has got the trim on it. Um and this it's alright, you know, I don't know how long it's gonna last. You don't know until you start using it. The only thing I will say is the Yamaha is a bit, it's not the best. I don't know how long that's going to last on there. A bit delicate. I won't, I won't be polishing that up. So that's going to go on there. And um, that's it really. So let's do a little bit on it. I haven't done anything to the engine yet. Um, I was revving it up in the, inside the garage. And if you hold it on full throttle, it's definitely bogging back. So I think it's learning, either running too rich and the other thing is the baffles might be all coked up, so I'll take those out and, and burn them off. Um, that's it. So uh, looking forward to getting done a little bit more work done on it. But I've been quite busy, so um, doing other stuff. But uh, even also, I'm look, looking at getting it registered. I've gone through the process of joining the, the Fizzy Owners Club, the chap there who runs it, um, per. He's um he's got the paperwork now, so hopefully he will chase up a new logbook for me. So that's it, that's it for now, folks. Bye.